So, so if I had one theme for today's session, it would be accelerate. What I want to do is help you accelerate the growth of your digital marketing agency. Take something that might take you know, five to seven years of trial, error, frustration, just because you got the wrong business model, the wrong marketing strategy, the wrong pricing, you know, whatever, give you the, the, the missing elements so that you can accelerate and really shortcut that. So you can start to experience the benefits and the freedom much earlier in your life. And so to me, if there's anything I really want for you guys, it's a, it's a business that can scale. Right? And so I'm going to draw out for you, I'm going to share with you guys the seven-figure model that's really worked exceptionally well for us. So I want a business that can scale, that will provide money. So, you know, the first thing that a business needs to do is, is provide income. It needs to provide the ability to pay the bills, to, to do the things you want to do. Provide freedom. Like we talked about the ability not just to work hard, but also to, to be able to do what you want to do. Right? For me, that's, that's this, right? I mean, I have an agency and it's paying the bills and it earns, but part of my passion is to serve others and to share what I've learned. So to have the freedom to do whatever it is that you enjoy doing and impact. And so that's, you know, if we look at the hierarchy of desires, you know, we want to have an impact. We want to do something that, that has a meaning. And so I want a business for you that will provide the money, the freedom, and the impact. The impact meaning you know, you're serving clients and getting them great results. You're building a team and pouring into them and helping them develop career tracks. And so in order to do that, you really have to be like great at three areas in your digital marketing agency. Uh, landing clients, you have to have a system and a process to land clients and get clients to hire your services. Uh, deliver results, so you have to be able to knock it out of your park and get your clients great results. And you have to retain long term. Like you have to have processes and systems so that when you do get a client, they're like, okay, this is great. I'm getting good results. I like the person that I'm working with, the company that I'm working with, and they continue to stay long term. When you've got those three things honed in in your business, you can really scale pretty quickly. So as it relates to landing clients, you need to, you need, first of all, you need to figure out a way to, to fill your funnel, right? To get prospects that know, like, and trust you, right? You have to build authority, position yourself as the expert because people will come to you and pay premium rates to work with the expert in their type of business. And you have to have sales mastery. You have to really know how to talk with a potential prospect, help understand what their issues, challenges are, and show them why you're the best solution, why they should hire you and trust you with their hard-earned dollars to generate sales, generate leads, and grow their digital marketing agency. It, you get those three projects dialed in, a full funnel, great authority, and a great sales process, you'll land clients and that will produce all of the money that you need on the, on the front end. The next piece is you have to deliver results, right? And I, I think that you know, the internet marketing space is a little bit devoid in this area, right? Everybody talks about how to get clients, how to do marketing, but there's very little information about how do we serve the clients? How do we get them great results? How do we get them a tangible, measurable return on investment? And so as it relates to this, you know, you, first of all, you gotta choose your model and make sure that you've got the right business model because if your business model's broken, like mine was, you can give it 110%. You can be pretty good at what you do, but if you're working on a broken business model, nothing else will work, right? So we're gonna, you know, you have to have a good business model and then you have to package and systematize. Again, if we wanna deliver results that scale, so that means that we can not only just get clients, serve them, but actually be able to get more and more clients without bottlenecking, you have to package and systematize. You've gotta have, first of all, a package that will get results for the client, but also that can be, um, can be systematized so that you can do it once really well, get it dialed in, and then do something very similar on a consistent basis. And then you've got to develop your team, right? You cannot do it all yourself. Eventually you're going to get to a place, maybe it's at 40, maybe it's at 50, maybe it's at 70 clients, where you just don't want to do it all yourself. You shouldn't do it all yourself. And so you've got to develop a team. You've got to put people around you that are good at the various areas in your company that, that you're not good at. And that's what gives you the freedom, right? Because you've got a, a business delivery system that makes sense. You can sell it without doing it yourself. Have a team that helps in every area of the company, from marketing, sales, to get the clients, to fulfillment and client relationship management. 
that gives you freedom so that you're not tethered to the business. You can go away on vacation. You can do webinars about things unrelated to your digital marketing agency. And you have to retain long term, right? You have to be strategic about what you do to keep a client with you month after month. And what I found the three key projects in that area are strong kickoff, like you have to have engineered when you get a client, what's the experience? What do they get in the mail? What is their intake process? You have to really dial that in. You have to develop your communication rhythm. So yes, you can, you can dial in the beginning, but why are they staying with you month after month after month? You have to have a great communication rhythm. What do you do on your monthly review calls? You have a monthly review call of some sort, right? What kind of information do you give to them in the reporting, right? What does that rhythm look like so that they feel the relationship? You know, the number one reason a client will leave is perceived indifference. Like, it, literally, they feel like you just don't, you don't care that much. And then the third thing from a retention perspective is to seed the vision. What I found in our agency, the main reason clients left was because they didn't feel they didn't feel like we were going to be able to help do what the next thing was. They didn't see what was coming up next on the horizon. And there's so much competition and so many people, you know, vying for their attention that you always have to be seeding the vision. Okay, hey, this is what we did this month. These are the results. How is that customer? How's it working for you? Great. Here's what we're going to focus on next. Here's what we're going to be doing in the next 30, 60, 90 days. And when you do that well, you'll be able to retain the clients at a much higher level. And so this is really the seven-figure agency model, right? You have to have these three projects with the three sub-projects. You've got this dialed in, and you can really do exceptional things in your digital marketing agency.